Hey everybody, welcome to Burr Tech. In this episode, I'm gonna be showing you a very simple tricks to make your projects more successful. All right, before we start this video, I wanna make sure that you like and subscribe. The reason why you subscribe to this amazing YouTube channel is to get the best tips and tricks to make you successful in whatever you wanna do. All right, so let's take a look at one simple trick to make you more successful in whatever project that you're trying to do. Now, I stumbled upon this trick because I was being a little bit lazy, but I was actually taking some time off as well. It's been a few weeks since I've made a Burratech video, and the reason is, is that whenever you do anything, you should always take some time off and maybe think about things and how to make things better, and that's exactly what I've done with Burratech. But one of the things that I found out when I was taking this time off is that I was being a little bit lazy in my spare time. So I developed this one amazing trick to help your projects move forward. So the, one of the reasons I developed this trick is because I wasn't getting a certain project done. I was basically putting it off and just not working on it at all. And this is a very simple trick to do with one of those projects that's kind of on the back burner and probably not your main project. If it's not your main project, you need to always work as hard as you possibly can and force yourself to get that project out the door because it's very hard to release things. And if you're not in the habit of releasing things, then you need to get in the habit of releasing things. So like a lot of producers, I have my main projects and some off projects and the off projects just weren't getting done. And the reason why they weren't getting done is because because I wasn't even opening up the coding editor at all. And this is where I finally discovered this trick. If you want to get something done, all you have to do is literally open it up and forget about productivity. So when I'm working on my main projects, I have a lot of deadlines, I need to get things done yesterday, and I need to make sure that they're done well enough to sell, to pay off everything that I own. But when it comes to other projects, productivity doesn't matter as much. If it's the projects that you're doing in your spare time, if you just simply open up the editor and get whatever it is you can get done in 10, 20, or 30 minutes, that's exactly what you wanna do. And if you can do this every day, those minutes start to add up. Now, one of the things that I used to do was always care about getting things done as quickly as possible. And of course, this doesn't make doing the project itself very fun, but it's what you need to do because, well, that's just reality. But if you're doing something in your spare time for fun, then maybe just work on it and forget about the productivity, just work on it. Maybe you get one tenth or one one hundredth of what you actually wanted to get done in that session. It doesn't matter, you're still working towards it. So let's say you have a spare project that takes 60 to 80 hours to complete. Now, if you really try to move that project out there, you might not get it done in the time because you might get burnt out. But if you take a very slow approach to this, then you might actually get it done. Let's say you do 15 minutes here, an hour there, maybe once a day, every day for the next six months, then you'll probably get that project out there. So everybody knows this story. It's the tortoise and the hare. Slow and steady wins the race. And if you're doing this in your spare time, this is probably something you wanna do. Just simply open up the coding editor or whatever it is you're trying to do, whether it's a video or whatever, just open it up and work on it. Forget about productivity and eventually you'll get there. Well, now of course, I always recommend people to have some spare projects to do in their spare time because the reason is, is that there's a lot of things you can be doing in your spare time and the best thing you can do is the spare projects to help your career. Now, the other things you can do in your spare time are, of course, exercising and meeting new connections, but those are stories for a different time. So please be sure to like and subscribe. So in conclusion, if you want to get something done, perhaps take the tortoise and the hare approach. That is slow and steady wins the race. If you really want to get something done, don't really worry about productivity. If it's your spare project, this is something that I highly recommend that you do. If it's your main project, perhaps you should really push that out there. And of course, this video wouldn't actually exist if I didn't take some time off. So remember, once you produce one or two projects or you have a bunch of projects going, it's always good to take some time off and look at what you've been doing from a distance. All right, so that concludes this video. Remember that this channel doesn't do Patreon and said we sell our digital products down below. The more money you get from the content that you buy below, the more content we can make, especially the free content on this channel. If you really like this channel, you can subscribe to Mammoth Interactive's huge library of content. We release 20 to 60 hours of fresh new content per month, every single month. And the more subscribers we get, the more content we can make. We would like to have 10,000 paid subscribers on our site, Mammoth Interactive. Links down below. We have monthly and yearly options. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in another video.